Which of the following equations describes the linear relation graphed above? So here's the graph. We can see it has a downhill slope. It has a y-intercept of 4. So choice number 1. The y-intercept here is correct. It is 4. However, the slope here is positive. A slope that's positive must be going uphill from left to right. So this is definitely not a choice. Now we have choice 2, but it's a bit complicated. So we can expand it out and write it in standard slope intercept form. We have y is equals to negative 4 over 3 x. Just going to distribute it out here. This here is negative 4 times 3 is 12 over 3. I'm multiplying this times this. And then here I'm going to add 8 to both sides. So the 8 here gets added at the end. Now when we add an 8 here, I'm going to try to combine these uh, two terms here by multiplying top and bottom by 3. So the 8 becomes a 8 times 3 is 24. And now when I look at this part here, 24 over 24 minus 12 is going to be positive 12, positive 12 over 3. So I'm going to look at this whole part here, and I'm going to replace it with positive 12 over 3 which is the same thing as 4. So let's rewrite it one more time here. We have negative 4 thirds x plus 4. So this here is a negative slope, which kind of makes sense. And this here is an intercept of 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. And now it's just a matter of confirming if this slope is correct. Now recall that slope is rise over run. So this is uh, the same thing as going down 4, which is 1, 2, 3, 4, and running 3 to the right. Positive 3 goes to the right. 1, 2, 3. So this slope indeed is correct. As for confirming choice number 3, let's simply rewrite it. We have 3y equals, going to push the 4x over which switches the sign, 4x, negative 4x. And then I'm going to push the negative 12 over, which also switches the sign, so it becomes positive 12. I'm going to divide each term by 3. We have y is equals to negative 4 over 3x plus 12 divided by 3 is going to be 4. And we have the same answer as before, and we have the same line, which is correct. So choice 2, choice 3 is correct, which means that choice D is the correct answer.